Welcome back to the UTEP Dynasty. Bring on the Aggies. UTEP gets ready to travel to Texas A&M. With their win-loss record, they have losses against number 15 Clemson, number 6 Ole Miss, 17 Arkansas, and Vandy. And they do have a win against number 8 Alabama, so I mean, that's got them going for something. But they are 2-4, and four. we are 3-1, and one, which means we have a better record than Texas A&M for the first time ever. So, I think this could be a, uh, a good game for us. And with that big game last week, we are now second for Drew Wright, and he's getting closer to signing with Texas Tech, but we are not too far behind him. So, hopefully we can move up more after hopefully beating a big 12 team in Texas A&M. Even though they are worse than us, um... They're better at us than everything. Uh, and we got the shaky needle of death, so... Oh, boy. Oh, no, it's raining. Let's see if we can uh, still win and hang on to the ball in the rain here. Oh, they get a big return to start off the game. That's not how you want to start a game. Oh, good hit, Wiggins, to knock that out. Oh, Wilson just got burned. Number two versus... No What's that foot? That better not be a face mask. That was not a face mask. How is he going to grab the face mask when he tackles him from behind? Makes no sense. Well, it looks like they're already cheating here. And good sack by Wally. Tackle him for minus four yards. He hold him. Let's try to hold him to a field goal here, guys. If we can hold him to a field goal on this drive, that would be a win for us. And, oh, we're going to do it. He steps out of bounds. Oh, what a stupid play by him. And we are only down three to nothing. We got lucky there. We have been using the run game a lot this season, and we are not turning away from that now. A good run to start off with for Hankins here. Eight yards. Oh, he breaks off a tackle, and he gets seven this time. What a pass and what a catch by Clark to hang on after he gets leveled. They're just going to leave my man Eldridge wide open like that? Yeah, we're going to make you pay every time you do that. Y'all didn't want Franklin to be throwing the ball against you here. Clark gets it into the end zone. Touchdown, UTEP. We are going to take the lead against Texas A&M. Oh, Liggins, you almost got there, man. He's, he gets stuck and still gets five yards. Yeah, we can't stop that, guys. Oh, Wilson, you could have had a pick six there, man. What are you doing? See, even if they score, I have faith in our high-powered offense. Just keep scoring, too, and we'll keep having to lead if we score touchdowns. Oh, what a bad pass. Fourth and five? Oh, I didn't even notice. Third and two, you trust Hankins with this. And that's why you trust Hankins. Franklin's going to keep it. And he's going to get big yards. Oh, he put a spin move. Oh, my goodness. What a run for Franklin. What in the world? Did you see that spin move he put on? Look at this spin move. He broke that man. And at the end of the first quarter, your UTEP Miners are up 7-3. I think we can actually win a game against a big premier school here. Well, that didn't work as I planned. Oh, cow, we almost got that. It definitely didn't work how I planned it, but that's okay. It's fourth and five, but I think we can get it. You don't win if you don't take gambles. And we get it. What a run by Hankins. Another good run by Hankins. Gets pushed back. Still gets three yards. I want to get him a touchdown here. Oh, he's going to cut up the middle. And he's going to get two. We're not at the first touchdown yet. But I think one more play and we can get him in there. Oh, why is Joseph in here? I wanted to get Hankins a touchdown. Eh, I guess Joseph can get one. And touchdown. Yeah. We're going to run this season, boys. And Wally just glitched out. All right. 
sending a blitz and that was not a good idea Wiggins is gonna get him after he gets 34 I don't think we should blitz this quarterback anymore because he's picking us apart every single time oh what a bad pass hold him to another field goal and we hold him to a field goal and we still have the lead 14 to 6 good route by Cowing Franklin's going to keep this one. Get him out of bounds before he gets hit and gets hurt. Oh, we're going to get sacked here. It'll be fourth and ten. Yeah, we're still going to go for it. Oh, God. They might brought everybody. RB's what? What? How did, how did you not get it over him? Oh, it's a run. They're getting their 99 overall running back some touches now. And another break tackle. And more break tackles. Are we getting back to that now? Good tackle, Wally. Good job not to let him get any more. Alright, good stop defense. Hold him one more time. And it is a pass play. Oh my gosh. What a catch. I thought that was going to go out of bounds. And at halftime, we are up by one. I still think we can pull this out. Hopefully, we don't implode like we usually do a bit against big schools. But I don't think we will. Let's not get away from our identity and let's keep running the ball here. Okay. Well, we've got to convert here, guys. Or not. Alright, good job, Catwing, to hold on to that. I knew I could have put my faith in you. Uh, and Hankins breaks off a tackle and gets a big gain. Definitely needed that one. And Joseph gets in untouched, gets his second touchdown of the day. Deion Hankins is still the better running back, but I'm glad we have Joseph. Oh, Wally, come on, man. You got to make that tackle. See, I don't like the animation where this, the guys carry them for like seven yards. It doesn't make sense. Run right up the middle. And he's just breaking off tackles left and right again. Ah, uh, man, I hate, I hate 99 overalls, dude. And wide open. Nope. It didn't even affect him. <laughs> he hit him in the feet and didn't even affect him at all. Pretty sure that's their 99 tight end. They're going for two to tie it here. And they get it. How did they get that? All right. Good take. Good take. And he breaks off a tackle, and he's going to take it for 35 yards. I expected to get at least a first down, and I didn't think I was going to get more than that. All right, Cowan. I was going to be pissed because you should have kept running that route. Touchdown, UTEP. We take the lead once again. And we had two people on him, and he still fits it in. I knew it was going to be a run, and Wally got stuck on a freaking defensive lineman. And he couldn't get anywhere. And at the end of the third quarter, we are up 28-21. It's going to come down to this quarter, and I have a feeling that we can pull it out if we can just stop and score here. Here comes the... Here comes the really worry, like. Oh, what a hit! Was that Ame Wu? Ame Wu just wrecked that man. Third and nine. Oh, they're gonna run it. He's gonna get. He's gonna get the touchdown, isn't he? It was third and nine, and they ran a draw play, and we let them score a touchdown. Come on, guys. Hankins, you only need one yard, man. You get this all the time. We got this. And he's not going to get it. It's going to be fourth and in inches. Hankins is going to take it. Good block from the outside. We're going to get the first down and more. Nine yards. That was a amazing block. That was clutch. All right, here we go. Oh, well, that was a quick snap. Yeah, let's get it out to Hankins. Wide open. Get that easy first down and more. 
But we gotta make sure that we get the score too. Pick up that block. Good block. And Hankins gets into the end zone. We are gonna take a seven point lead with 38 seconds left. That was a clutch drive by our offense there. All right, keep them making the throw short. Make them call the timeouts. Good play, good play. Oh, he's wide open. Oh, no. Oh, no. How did that happen? How did he get so wide open like that? We have 16 seconds left. We need a miracle to win this game right now. I don't want to take it to overtime here. That is not what I had in mind. They're already in field goal range. We're going to lose this game, aren't we? We're going to lose this game, guys. It's going to be all my fault. And it all comes down to this. Hopefully he'll miss it here. It's up. And it's good. With one second left. That's all she wrote, boys. We almost had the win. The only miracle we have is if Cowan can get a touchdown here. And he can't, and that's going to do it. And after that awful sequence, when it was tied, where he threw the interception, we lose the game 38-35. to but they are still an SEC school, and they still beat number 8 Alabama, and we almost got the win. I still have faith. Still have faith that this season is going to be good, and we're still most likely going to win this conference. So, let's just hope. I mean, it was a good overall performance. Our defense gave up too many points and too many big plays, but our offense sure did do amazing until that last drive. But, you know... It happens. Tight fight. UTEP couldn't quite pull off the W against Texas A&M. But we got pretty freaking close and that's all that matters. It's not easy walking out of the stadium with your head up after a loss. Do you not real- Okay. Alright. Nothing. I'm not even going to say anything about that. In the next episode, we are back taking on our conference opponent and our rival UTSA. And hopefully we can get back to winning and stay above 500 and not at 500. But... With that being said, that's all I got for this episode, and I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making it, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace. Oh, he breaks off the tackle. What a good run for me. It's all you, man. And you dropped it. What a hit by Wally. He was swarming off the... Oh, man. What?